that was, of course, uh, Brian Dirksen, It Is Time. Well, if you're dealing with frustration today, I have just a little thought for you. First of all, you need to recognize why you are frustrated. Secondly, you need to take a moment and say, okay, God, I'm, I'm dealing with a little bit of frustration today, so I really need your help. Then you need to identify why it is that you are frustrated. And then, of course, you're thinking to yourself, is what I'm looking at, is it really an unmet, unmet realization, or am I just putting too many higher goals for myself? And then, of course, you know, go to prayer. So today, we're going to pray for those who are feeling frustrated. So Father, today, we know that so many times, Lord, we put unrealistic expectations on ourselves, or we allow someone else to do that today, and it creates frustration. So Lord, today, in this time of frustration, or in a time of frustration today, let us remember that, Lord, you have a plan and purpose for our lives. And I'm always thinking about Proverbs 3, 5, and 6 in times like this, where it says, trust the Lord with all your heart. Don't lean to your own understanding, but always acknowledge him and he will direct your path. Lord, thank you today that we have a couple of wonderful avenues in which, Lord, we can reduce our frustration. Number one, the word of God. Just spending time with your word and getting your perspective is so very, very important. And Lord, we're asking, Lord, that right now that would happen. And secondly, Lord, we have the avenue of prayer. What a wonderful blessing that in itself is, that we can bring our frustration, our unmet expectations, our unrealistic expectations that we either put on ourselves or someone puts on us. Father, we bring them before you. We are going to simply put our trust in you, and we're going to do what we have to do, Lord, to get the job done. But Father, all of these things are placed in your hand. And you made a wonderful promise, and that is that, Lord, you are going to give us divine assistance. So, Lord, we're just going to receive that divine assistance right now, and we're going to thank you, Lord, for how that you're going to help evaporate, Lord, and dissipate and deal with our frustration. Lord, thank you for that today. And we're also going to pray that your wonderful peace, your wonderful love, and your strength is going to come in us right now. Lord, we're receiving it right now. I, I love what Paul says. He says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. Lord, that's going to help us, Lord, to deal with our frustration, our unrealistic expectations. We thank you for all of these things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In sales, you may be used to working